Hi, Super Sus here, back with another Antimatter Dimension New Game Plus 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 video, episode 38. And you can see the quantum button is there again. It says I need to go quantum gain one quark. But my new strategy is to go for two quarks. So that's what I'm going to do. It's not that far away in meta antimatter. I can look at dilation. I'm I can get this. I I'm not sure if I'm gonna get this. If I should get this or not, um, it's sort of it's, it's debatable because if I get this, it's um, my meta dimensions are not going to be as powerful. But if we go to mastery studies, it's okay that I can't get that. That that is perfectly fine. I can eternity again, and may, maybe the eternity points could help. I will just try to dilate once, just to see. If I can gain any more tachyon particles, it doesn't. Uh, actually, no. It's because I I don't have the right tree. I can just respec and go into this. Get anything. Actually, I got the wrong thing. I have to respec again. Get anything that. Um, I'm just gonna get the meta dimensions for now, and. And then just dilate. And maybe, yeah, I can get a few more tachyon particles. Not that powerful, but it's something. And it, that, that's that. I can um, go to Mastery Studies and just respect again. And just go into my normal build. And, and just really get those meta dimensions up to the uh, amount I need. I... I need E464, so yeah, when I get there, I'm going to go quantum, so see you then. Okay, I'm back a few hours later, and I'm ready to not only eternity for E1 million eternity points, I I can, I can finally have my meta antimatter up to E464, which is enough to get two quarks. So yes, I'm going to go quantum again. For the second time, I, I, I'm excited, even though it's not going to really do anything. Let's just see what we have. We have 316 times dilated time production. And also, my, my strategy, I'm not going to, I'm going to get the two quarks. I'm not going to assign them until right before the next quantum. And I'll assign it to red when I do that. And right now... Going quantum seems like transcending and clicker heroes, which actually I, I did today. I'm going off topic a little bit, but I did a transcension at like zone 278,000, which is pretty it's pretty far in the game. The next one's going to be at like over zone 1 million. But anyway, I think I'm just ready to go quantum again. It's, it's a bit like transcending because it takes a long time to get back to where you were. Like sometimes an obnoxiously long time, just like clicker heroes. And yeah, so three, two, one. There we go. Quantum resets everything. And you can see. So, okay. Oh, whoa, it has quantum time. So, last quantum time was 10 days um, and eight hours. So, that, that's 248 hours. I should probably get that down. So, I think it's just. I should probably just. I should probably just get the infinity upgrades. So, because they're just easy to get and and and, and they're less they're easy to get and yeah, I, I, I and I'm just going to go for a fastest crunch here and it's going to be the same thing really. It, it's it's really just going to be the same exact thing as episode 30 because I'm, I'm gonna I will have new strats which I will be talking about then um, my, my new strats okay so and then we can just do challenges just like before so yeah see you when I when I can actually have some um, strategy because it's my strategy is going to change a bit with um, especially um, it's, it's going to change for pre-dilation, but like post-eternity. So yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, it's been more than a bit. It's been like over a day, as you can see, from the quantum time. And it's I've, I've gone pretty far down the tree. And I 
like from the from just like the overnight, I got a lot of time theorems, which can get me many time studies. You can see the I'm already getting like um, more time theorems from the infinity points and the antimatter. It's not gonna really maybe maybe once I eternity again, it'll be more. It'll be a little bit better. And I'll, I'll start explaining my new strategy. So what my new strategy is going to be, I'm, I'm only going to grind Eternities up to... Actually, I'm going to um, respect my tree. Um, I, I'm only going to grind Eternities up to... What is it? Uh, up to 20,000. And the reason why I am... Um, only doing that is because you act you don't need to actually to unlock dilation. You only need five attorney challenge eleven and five attorney challenge twelve completions. You don't need it from attorney challenges one to ten, which can be a great help. So you can see I'm just I'm I'm pressing R right now and and that's what I'm doing. But what I'm gonna do, um, after that. Is actually I'm just gonna, I'm I'm gonna turn the I'm gonna turn some of my auto buyers off just right now because they're just being I, I can get way more than what they're doing so it's just it's just gonna make it these new strategies are gonna make this quantum faster than last quantum even though I don't really have any like physical boost to how fast it is. It's still going to be faster just because my strategies are just so much better. And maybe I can even get... I'm not sure how many total eternity points I've gotten. I don't think it's that much. So yeah, I I, I think it was somewhere around quintillion, which actually means I can get this. The achievement bonus affects time dimensions, and that can that can help. That, that can really help. Um... I always forget these eternity upgrades. I, I was doing that like over and over. I was just forgetting the eternity upgrades for just some reason. So I still need to crunch to get to eternity. Um, I'm gonna get study 181 soon. So what, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do um, automatic eternity. I, it's gonna be just amount and it'll be eternity as quick as possible and it's just good to go E or one E. I'm just gonna do one E three hundred because he started at E twenty five. So, so yeah. Now I'm getting it like in half a second or even or less. So, and I can just get a few time theorems. It's not it's not that useful. So, yeah. See you in a bit when I when I um, explain some more strats, more new strats. This turn this quantum. Okay, I'm back a day later, and you can see I've gone a bit above the 20,000 I was going for, but I think these extra attorneys will really help because attorney upgrades, this upgrade is just now OP. So, it's it's okay. I'm not going to 100,000, though. That That's the thing. I only need to beat the challenge once, and that's that's the huge thing. I only need to beat the challenge once. So, if I, just, I can just disable this and... I'm just, I'm just gonna auto crunch here. It's it's, and look how much more powerful it is. Just because of the, it's, I think it's just because of this upgrade. Look how much more powerful that is. I suddenly have nearly 200 time theorems, and I now I now have over 200. So that means I'm just gonna beat um, this challenge real quick. This should be really easy. There we go. I bet I, I'm just gonna go into attorney points. It's not the greatest, but it'll do. I'll get that, and there we go. Slow the preset again, and then I'm gonna. I'm really gonna do eternal challenge two, which is also easy-ish. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, that, that, that at least one time. I'm, I'll do later. Um, playthroughs of that a little later. This I think also should be really easy. Yeah, I, I'm gonna be able to do all five of those, so yeah, see you see you there because it's gonna take a while. Actually no, it's because the stupid requirement takes a long time. And also look at this. I have study one eighty one. That that's what's preventing me from doing it. Also I shouldn't be crunching anymore because I don't need to crunch. That's the amazing thing about study one eighty one.
also, oh no, I, I, I can just get, I, just, I can just get this, and that, that can be, that's pretty powerful. It's a time dimension upgrade, and hopefully I'll have enough to get this, which is quite powerful. So many time studies, I can go up to 95, so that's enough to, just gonna eternity and um, beat this challenge. Again, I really wish I had that six hour quantum speed run. So I, I don't have to just keep doing this because it's just an annoying. Attorney challenges are really annoying at this point. Like, attorney challenges 13 and 14 are, are fun. But just 1 through 12 are just painful. So here we go again. Should probably be actually going the infinity dimension. Also, I haven't even pressed R. Yeah, if, if I press R, that's going to suddenly. I was somehow doing that without any replicated galaxies, so. Also, I can actually get this upgrade, which is powerful, and also I, I can get this, which is. Um, speeding this once is just gonna be really useful, because now I can get Replicanti three times faster. Yeah, I'm beating that challenge like it's nothing. The other strategy is just beat Attorney Challenge. 10 first time, 10 just once, and then that, that's where you unlock all those other studies. So, you could probably go into 6, which is really easy. So, just I'm just gonna be 6 five times. There you go, that was the fifth time. And you can see, I, I have quite a bit of time theorems right now. If I just buy max the 240 time theorems. Probably should be able to be doing all the other completions of Turning Challenge 2. You can just see how, how easy these Attorney Challenges are. I do have 40,000, so yeah, I already I already did beat um, Attorney Challenge 1 twice. And just the rewards are going to be really nice for a little bit later. So now I, I, I'm just going to go, I think I have the idle preset. Yeah, idle, which lets me go into a training challenge eight, which should be possible. Yeah, I'm getting E20. Okay, I can do it twice, looks like. Turning on training challenge eight is a little bit harder. I should probably, yeah, just be pressing R. And then I'm, I'm for training challenge seven, I can just go to eternity points. And it's... I think I can do like the first three or so completions, like see how far I get. So about E3600, so I'm just taking note of that. Because that's what I do with the challenges, turning challenges sometimes. Actually, no, I'm pressing R, and so I'm going way past that. So I think that's enough to complete it. Yeah, 3060, no problem. So I'm going above E5000. Any points. E3590. It takes a little longer, but it's okay. And then, fifth completion of Attorney Challenge 7. I, I, th I thought this was supposed to be a bit harder, but whatever. <laughs> so now it's missing Attorney Challenge 4. I'm not doing that because it is just. It's too much of a, of a grind to get the banked infinities. And I think I should. I don't want enough theorems yet, but just a few more eternities, and I'll have enough theorems to do Attorney Challenge 9. So, uh, yeah, now I have enough to do Attorney Challenge 9. And let's see. Okay, I can do that. Let's see, I want to increase. Okay, I can do it twice. I, I, do, I do need to just keep track of this. Maybe I can do Attorney Challenge 8 a little bit more. So I have to go into idle for that because I have quite a bit more. Yeah, well, look. Yes. Okay. E ten thousand. That, that. Okay. Turning challenge eight is is able to be completed five times. Probably just because of like extra time dimension things that I didn't have before. And also, just attorney challenge rewards. Maybe I can do nine the third time. I'm just gonna get some eternity points for now. It is pretty important to try to get as many challenge completions before Attorney Challenge uh, 10 because Attorney Challenge 10 
is really, really, really annoying. Let's see how far. Okay, I can go up to E20, approximately 2700. That. Yeah, that'll at least let me complete it four times. And maybe if I'm just, I'm just gonna manually do it this time. Pick something a little bit better. Actually, maybe normal dimensions is the ba way to go. I'm, wait, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna check this challenge. What is it? Can't buy tick speed upgrades. And then, if you need power, multiplies. Okay, I, I would say time dimensions are the best for eternity challenge nine. That, that's what I'm gonna say. And yeah, I should have enough. I don't even have enough infinity power. Oh, because I don't have this. Okay, there we go. I think I can beat it with the better tree. Yeah, there we go. So now I'm just I'm just gonna maybe just do one more run for eternity points and then maybe two more. It, it, it's just it, eternity challenge ten is the worst. Especially just the first time. Attorney Challenge 10, first time, is terrible. I, I hate it. I hate it. It's it's banked in... Fin it's where you have to just... I get so many infinities. So I, I just have to do time for this. 5.00001. The only way to beat this challenge is... To just get so many infinities. And it's the worst. So yeah, see you after I beat the challenge once. Okay, it actually wasn't that bad. It was like 10 minutes to beat the challenge. Could have probably been less. I, I just forgot to press R and, that, and that's what it was. So yeah, that now I can, fin I can finally um, get some new studies beyond. Actually, it's just auto-picking them for me. Should be good enough to get some things. But I, I would prefer some different studies because I because I'm like using the preset and it probably shouldn't be so I'm just I'll just respec and manually do it. And probably should be picking infinity dimension, not normal dimension. It's just faster to do infinity dimensions. This this I do have enough to get um, study one ninety two, which is the one where you can go beyond infinite replicanti. It's not that fast though actually, it's probably not worth it to get that, so I'm, I'm going to just manually do it again. I'm, I'm manually doing it so much. But yeah, the strategy, what I'm going to do is this quantum, and I'm going to, this strategy is to just, the strategy is just like, uh, get farther down the tree, focus on this study, and then grind eternity challenge 11. So, yeah. Next episode will be a dilation. So, yeah. Peace out.